Western Mass News is your local sports authority. The New England Patriots just a few days out from their first preseason game. Western Mass News reporter Kayla Burton joins us live in studio with more on how they're looking with the season right around the corner. Kayla, here we go again. Here we go. It's here. It's almost here. And Chris, the Patriots getting in a few more practice days before their first game on Thursday already here. They'll take on the Washington football team and it's the first of three preseason games they're going to be playing. Now, the Patriots are looking up this year, aiming towards a comeback season after struggling last year, just finishing 7-9 and nine on the season. The team has been taking absolute full advantage of these practice days and fans getting to enjoy all of it as well. Today marks the team's 11th overall practice so far and their fourth day practicing in full pads. Tight end Devin Asiasi also back in the mix today after having to quarantine due to testing positive for COVID-19 despite being vaccinated. Head coach Bill Belichick updates Western Mass News on his status heading into game week one. Out here is participating. Uh, we'll monitor his progress and, um, and just kind of take it, not even day by day, I'd say, you know, monitor as he goes through practice, you know, how, how he's doing and, um, you know, until we're sure that he's ready to, you know, go out and, you know, be a full participant, but I'd say we're not quite there yet. But I, you know, I don't know how that's gonna how that's gonna go. As I said, we've dealt with that with um, a few other players, and some have reacclimated quicker than others. Um, but again, we, we just have to stay on top of it and monitor. And speaking of tight ends, new tight end Hunter Henry was not on the field as well today after injuring his shoulder over the weekend. He is expected to get an MRI. However, the injury doesn't appear to be all too serious, but he could miss some time in the preseason. And quarterback Cam Newton paying extra attention to the fans during training camp, if you've seen. He's been handing out footballs to the fans while hyping up the crowd almost at the end of every practice. And the team really looking forward to seeing thousands making their way back to Gillette Stadium for their first in-person preseason game on Thursday, something they really haven't experienced in over a year due to COVID, so it should be awesome. For now, live in studio, Kayla Burton, Western Mass News.